Hey, Shalom, Akim, to Yabba Tazah. I want to give all praises and glory and honor to Yabba Shem Shai. Double honor to the elders of Great Millstone. Much love and respect to all you brothers out there doing the work in sincerity and truth, striving for the hopeful elect, enduring all afflictions, and seeking out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Yabba Shem Yawashai, Wahab Rakak Badash, Barakatam Akim. All right, um, I just want to go into basically speaking about uh, these Edomites, so-called white men, and you two-thirds that love to sit under his table and eat the crumbs off his table. Okay, Esau, the so-called white man, you know, he is the devil, and the word devil, Diablos, goes back to the word a deceiver. Okay. A liar or a false accuser okay um, in the book of the Apocrypha in the book of uh, what is it uh, the book of Sirach never trust thine uh, never trust thine enemy okay those are commandments man and when you and when the so-called white man Esau crosses you be of no uh, surprise man because you were told this, okay? And each brother should always be on the, uh, the, or should always be vigilant and knowing his, his, um, you know, his adversaries, the enemies. The enemies are everywhere, man. When you're in this truth, enemies are everywhere, every single place. Every, everyone you look at is potential enemy. All right. Why? Because. You are uh, of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Your spirit is different from their spirit. You're, you're not of the same cloth. Okay, you're not of of the same uh, garment. Okay, and they will uh, um, devise to 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 try to uh, come at you, attack you, raise a false report. Okay, all because of, all because you're uh, different and you're of you're a man. Yahweh Bashem Yahweh said he didn't give us a spirit of fear, you know, that we're subject under the powers that be, but to a certain degree, rather obey God than men, okay? So when it comes to certain things, you know, be, be not surprised when these devils cross you, man. You know, it just, it just heaping more coals of fire upon their head whenever they do do that, all right? So this is John 8 and 42. Yeah, I wish I said unto them, if the Most High were your father, you would love me. You see, can two well, at least they be agreed? You know, he said, if you if you love if you if the Most High was your father, right? You believed in Yahweh Shai, right? The Heavenly Father and His Son. You you everybody be walking in in, in agreement, man. You know. Things would be different on the planet Earth because everybody would be following the law, statutes, and commandments. You know? Um, you would love me. See? And then um, brothers that come in the name of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, they don't, have, they don't always have to be about preaching. It's just you being there. If they can't accept you, man, you know, they're basically just uh, uh, rejecting Yahweh Shai because Yahweh Shai, when he came into the scene, Yahweh Shai, he was a rough man, man. He was an austere power. Okay? And the word austere goes back to being, he was morally strict. He was serious, man. Yahweh Shai wasn't to be played with. And they knew this. Okay? And that's why eventually they ended up putting him to death because... He wasn't according to their ways. He wasn't part of that system. The Roman, uh, the Roman Empire, and then the Pharisees and the scribes, which were Israelites, they followed after the Romans, man. That's who they were really uh, afraid of. They said, "We have no other master, or we have no other king but Caesar." Crucify him. That's what they said about Yahweh Shai. So this is that's why I said this is regarding to you Edomites and you two third Negro Latinos and Native American Indians that love eating underneath this man's table, man, like dogs. You know, and you hate truth. You know? It says, neither came I of myself, but he but he sent me. You know, each of each of us brothers, man. 
you know, we we what we, we we live in this life thinking that we know where we're going, where we're gonna be staying at one night, what we're gonna be eating, but we don't really know what Yahweh Bashem Yahweh has planned for us or where he's gonna send us. You know? And and you'll be surprised the things that he does, man. Just by sending us brothers different places and what um what brothers are doing in those cities. You know? You know, sending like an angel to to uh to check out the uh the the, the, the area and, and, and they bring a report to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai and they weigh it in the in a in a balance and then the judgment is cast on a place, man. Because every place in America, like Yahweh Shai said, no stone shall be left upon another, man. Meaning that not all, all these cities and towns and uh, rural, you know, and urban places, they're, they're all going to be judged. They're not going to get away. You know, it says, why do you not understand my speech? You know, we, we speak clear to these people. We give them the truth. You know, there ain't no guile found in our mouth. And they still find it as... as a, a, a being a false a witness or a false testimony or it's not the truth you know even though we show them by our works you know that that we're uh, like Yahweh Shah he showed his works man he was healing the sick you know protecting and speaking up for the poor you know and rebuking those that needed re rebuke and healing those that needed to be healed but, but yet they still hated him man you know, that's why I said, why do you not understand my speech? Everything that he's saying was the truth. You know? But they find those brothers to be liars, deceivers, yet true. You know? Yet a uh, uh, known but unknown. Or unknown yet known. So all these, like the, like us brothers, we, we, tell, we, we always say that everybody's going to know this truth. And they're going to know that they, they, they're not going to have no excuse in that day Saying um, nobody uh, told us of this Yes You just didn't want to hear it You didn't want to see it You know You didn't want to believe the men that I sent out You didn't want to understand my men that were sent out It's like they didn't want to understand Yahweh Shah They thought he was crazy They thought he had a devil They thought he was a madman They thought he was Beelzebub You know not realizing that they were speaking to a child of, of the Most High. Yahweh Shai. They spoke down against the Creator, man. And you, and you brothers that are out there that are the elect and these men, you know, that, that talk down on you, that raise a false report on you, those people are going to get a horrible judgment upon them, man. Horrible. Not realizing that those men, the elect, those men, were had pretty much by them treating you a certain way had the ability to, to, to save you. Not the Edomites, don't get me wrong, I ain't speaking about Esau. Esau's Esau's condemned. But you two thirds, even the two thirds are, but we don't know who the two thirds and the one third is, but by their works we shall know them by their fruit. But you know what I'm saying. They're bringing in that heavy damnation upon themselves every time they cross a brother, man. It says, even because you cannot hear my word, ye are of your father the devil, and the lust of your father ye will do. They love to lie, man. They love raising false reports. Okay? Like it says in the book of Revelations, he accuseth, he accuseth us uh, night, day and night to the father, man. You know? Raising false reports, he'll set he'll set up a, a, a trap for you and be like, "Look, see." But yet, it, it was done through uh, maliciously. It was done through his the wiles of the devil, trickery, and caused uh, a stumbling block to be set before a, a, a man. That's how these devils operate, man. They're they're demons. They work for the, the great Babylon. They work for the beast. All these corporations, these schools, um, everything out here is, is somehow connected to the beast. And they're part of that spirit. And the only way you'll really see it 
is if the most high is dealing with you and you're a spiritual man you'll see it it says he was a murderer from the beginning and abide not in the truth they don't abide in the truth they don't come and seek Yahweh they seek their own belly they seek uh, monetary gain they seek to uh, please men wicked men proud men right they'll, they'll, they'll help to uh, they'll help each other to, to, to cast down a poor man and lift up the rich you know but that's fine because we need offenses to come we need these things to happen and us brothers you know it hurts you know it, it gets it gets tiring knowing that we can't ever uh, just do what we have to do without somebody fucking with us but hey offenses must come in order for Yahweh Bashem Yahweh's judgment to be on point and to be um, to be devastating, it has these offenses have to be have to come because Yahweh Bashem Yahweh's his anger is nothing equal to ours. We can get mad, but Yahweh Bashem Yahweh's anger is is is, is, is it far it far exceeds us, man. And he's gonna do it perfectly, you know. It says because there is no truth in him. When he speaketh, uh, when he speaketh the lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is a liar and the father of it, man. You see? So these Edomites, they're 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 the, the damn devil. Every single one of you fucking Edomites, man. Never trust your enemy. Okay? Never trust your enemy. It says. And abide not in the truth because there is no truth in him. Right. They don't believe in the, in the scriptures. They don't believe in following the law, statutes, commandments of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. They don't, even, they don't even care about seeking out if, that, if Jesus is the right name or not. You know? You know you, even you fucking two-thirds that, that fall in this category, your father is the devil, man. Your father is Esau. That's your daddy. You know that's who you bow down to that's why when Yahweh says who 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 shall rise up against the evil doers for me that's what the most is looking for you know there's gonna come a time where you have to rise up against these goddamn devils and there's in the beast the system you know there's times where you're gonna fall back. There's times where you're gonna just, you know, uh, you know, uh, play it safe, agree with that adversary. But there's gonna be times where you're gonna have to fucking, you have to speak up. You have to let them know. You know, but every brother has his own lot. You know what I'm saying? But the spirit of the Lord, when it's put on you to do it, you know, it's a good thing. Shake the dust off your feet. The most is gonna bring judgment upon these places, man. These cities, these towns, these corporations, these educational systems. Everything here in America is gonna be destroyed. You two thirds, man. Y'all are the, the 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 father of the devil. That's who y'all worship, man. Y'all worship the devil. Y'all show reverence to the devil. And then meanwhile, you you, you see you see your fellow brother, your brother. Or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Fall down, man. And you're taking part in it. It's like I did see how was shy. It says, and because I tell you the truth, you believe me not. Right, Yahweh Shai told you the damn truth. And you still don't want to believe. You sit there and tell these motherfuckers the truth. And they'll still raise a false report. Get false witnesses. It's crazy, man. Brothers, get ready, man, because... These people are already, they're already set in their ways and they're ready to give false reports. They're ready to, to, to tell lies on you and see you be destroyed. And they're actually going to start, they're going to do it, you know, where they're actually going to try to touch brothers, man. You can't forget about that. A lot of these people are going to raise false reports against you, man. And you got to stand solid and firm. You know, because at the end of the day, what do they want? They want you to bow down. Well, guess what? Can't bow. You know, the scriptures say, Yahweh said, 
Fear no man on earth, but fear him that has the power to destroy the body and the soul, man. Because at the end of the day, man, that's what these Edomites want. These two third, uh, uh, these two thirds that they, they want you to bow down, man. And they hate the fact that they they've lost. And they still see that you you are that that rarity, that man. Like the scriptures say, man shall be um, a, a man shall be more uh, rare than the gold of Ophir in that day. This place got to go, man. This place is full of evil. All right, liars, deceivers. You know what I'm saying? Go over here. See, it's Second Timothy three, and uh, it says Second uh, Timothy two and three. But thou hast fully known my doctrine, manner of life, purpose, faith, long suffering, charity, patience, persecutions, afflictions, which came unto me at Antioch. At I I Iconium and Lystra, what persecutions I endured, but out of them all the Lord delivered me. You see, like each brother has his own story. Every brother has his own afflictions, persecutions. Like Paul, he mentioned Antioch, Iconium, uh, Lystra. Like me, catching hell in San Angelo in Midland, Texas. Like I said in, in prior videos, you have different people but with the same spirit in these every city and town man i don't know the exact number but of those spirits but they're all similar they're more common than you think they just got different names they have different uh, a, a, a different body shape size color but the spirit's always the same it says what persecutions i endured but out of them all the lord delivered me Yea, and all that will live godly and Yahweh Shahamashiach shall suffer persecution. You're gonna be hated. Why? Because you're a child of light. You're, you're a child of truth, man. You're a child of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Right? It says, But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. You see? It's just gonna get worse. While the, while the brothers and the elect are being sealed and increasing in the power of wisdom, and wisdom knowledge, and understanding of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, the two thirds are going to be increasing in, 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 in their um, wickedness. Right? Like I said, but evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse. They're going to continue to increase in that and, and deceiving and being deceived, man. All these places here, man. Everything that's why Yahweh Shai said, as I said before, not one stone shall be left upon another. All these people are gonna be destroyed. All these businesses, corporations, educational systems, uh 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 these prison houses, it, uh, uh the Roman Catholic Church, all the religions, all the idols are going to be destroyed. The money, the gold here, everything's gonna be destroyed, man. But continue thou in the things which thou hast learned and has been assured of, knowing of whom thou hast learned them. And that's all we got, man. This is all we have is this truth. Fuck everything else. Because Paul said, I, I, I count everything but lost as dumb. All, basically, all the things that Paul has lost, count, he counts them as dumb, man. It's all pieces of shit. All these jobs are pieces of shit. These people that govern them are pieces of shit proud wicked faggot homosexual people man that rule um these businesses that rule the educational systems the lawyers the judges a bunch of faggots man feminine feminine fem fem you know which we know the word uh, uh to be feminine is is meaning minus faith they have no faith man they don't believe in our power, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Why? Because the, the father, the devil is their father, man. It 
lessons, but continue down the things which thou hast learned. So we, that's what we need to continue in. You know? Why? Because we have this. This is our job, man. This is our this is our true livelihood. This is our true 401k, man. Right here. We're storing up uh, uh, treasure in heaven. Where no man can take it away, man. Only Yahweh was shy. Or by because of our own stupidity. But only Yahweh by Shemiah was shy. You know what I'm saying? He's the one that sustains us and keeps us. Not no man. Not no goddamn money. It says, and that from a child thou hast known the holy scriptures, which are able to make thee wise unto salvation through faith, which is in Yahweh Mashiach. Make us wise. Right? The wisdom of the world is, 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 is foolishness unto the Most High. So that don't make you wise. It dumbs you down. It don't make you wise. You know? This place is full of evil, man. Wicked people, liars, deceivers. Edomites, you so-called white people are goddamn liars, man. You two-third Negro Latinos and Native American Indians. Goddamn liars, man. Alright. Let's go over here to the book of Revelation. I believe it's it might be chapter 22. But uh find it real quick. 21 uh, Revelations uh, 21 and 7 He that overcometh shall inherit the, all the, all things and how do you overcome the world is by uh, taking uh, heed and keeping unto Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding and doing what is uh, obligated of you alright which is going unto the highways and byways you know presenting your body a living sacrifice you know uh, uh, you know denouncing the evil in the world, things of that nature. You know, obeying the law, statutes, and commandments. He that overcometh shall inherit all things. And I will be his God, and he shall be my son. But the fearful and unbelieving, and the abominable, and murderers, and whoremongers, and sorcerers, and idolaters, and all liars shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. So America has all those things that it's mentioned. All those things that it mentioned here in verse 8. America holds. The whole world is engulfed and plagued by these wicked people. So they're going to take part in that second death. Which is what? By way of fire. Thermal nuclear destruction. So with that. Kwam uh, Yasha'Allah. Shalom.